What if I told you that some of the greatest scientific minds in history were Jewish? The annals of scientific advancement are filled with the names of Jewish scientists who have left indelible marks in various fields. Their contributions have shaped our understanding of the universe, redefined medical practice, and paved the way for technological leaps. We're talking about geniuses like Albert Einstein, who made us rethink the very fabric of space and time, or Jonas Salk, who created the first effective polio vaccine, saving countless lives. Their stories are not just about scientific discovery, but also about perseverance, vision, and a relentless quest for knowledge. They've left a legacy that continues to inspire and push the boundaries of what we think is possible. So buckle up and let's journey through the annals of scientific history, shall we? First on our list is none other than Albert Einstein, the father of modern physics. Now, when you think of a genius, the image of Einstein with his wild hair and thoughtful expression probably pops into your mind, and rightly so. His contributions to science are immeasurable, but let's focus on one, the theory of relativity. This isn't just E equals mc squared, folks. This groundbreaking theory redefined the way we understand space and time merging them into one interwoven continuum known as space-time. Imagine shaking a tablecloth and how the ripples move across. That's kind of how Einstein described gravity. Mind-blowing, right? In 1921, his brilliance was officially recognized with the Nobel Prize in Physics, but his influence extended far beyond that. Einstein's work radically altered the course of theoretical physics and cosmology and continues to inspire scientists today. Einstein's work has left an indelible mark on how we understand the universe. Next up is Niels Bohr, the man who changed our understanding of the atom. Born in Denmark and of Jewish descent, Bohr made groundbreaking contributions to our understanding of atomic structure and quantum mechanics. His work was so revolutionary that it earned him the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1922. Bohr proposed a theory that electrons travel in specific orbits around the nucleus and that the chemical properties of an element are largely determined by the number of electrons in the outer orbits. This theory helped to form the foundation of quantum mechanics, a field that continues to shape our understanding of the universe today. Moreover, Bohr's concept of complementarity, which states that an electron can be both a particle and a wave, but can be either, not both at the same time, has been integral to the development of atomic physics. Bohr's work on atomic structures paved the way for further developments in nuclear physics and quantum mechanics. Let's turn our attention to Jonas Salk, the man who saved countless lives with his polio vaccine. Born in 1914, Salk was an American medical researcher and virologist who dedicated his life to fighting polio, a crippling and potentially deadly infectious disease. Salk's journey was not an easy one. The task before him was daunting, to develop an effective vaccine for a disease that had been ravaging the world for centuries. But Salk was not deterred. He worked tirelessly, conducting research and running countless tests until he finally achieved his goal. The polio vaccine was introduced in 1955 and it was nothing short of a medical miracle. This vaccine was a game changer. It provided a line of defense against a disease that had previously been unstoppable. Thanks to Salk's tireless efforts, the threat of polio has significantly decreased. Salk's vaccine has virtually eradicated polio, marking a significant victory in the fight against infectious diseases. Now let's dive into the world of biophysics with Rosalind Franklin. Born in the early 20th century, Franklin was a British scientist who was instrumental in decoding the mysteries of life's most fundamental building blocks. With her expertise in X-ray crystallography, she ventured into the uncharted territories of DNA, RNA, viruses, coal, and graphite. A pioneer in her field, Franklin's most significant contribution was to the understanding of DNA's structure. Her X-ray diffraction images of DNA were groundbreaking. They revealed the molecule's double helix structure, a discovery that revolutionized biology and medicine. Franklin's work didn't stop with DNA. She also made substantial contributions to our understanding of RNA, viruses, coal, and graphite's molecular structures. Her studies on viruses paved the way for the development of antiviral drugs, and her research on coal and graphite had significant implications in the energy sector. Franklin's work laid the foundation for our understanding of genetic information and how it shapes life. Next, we have Leon Letterman, the physicist who gave us insights into the elusive neutrino. 
Born in 1922, this American physicist spent his life diving into the mysteries of the universe. Among his most significant works was his research on neutrinos, elusive particles that are incredibly difficult to detect due to their lack of electric charge. Alongside his colleagues Melvin Schwartz and Jack Steinberger, Letterman discovered a new type of neutrino, a feat that earned them the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1988. This discovery was a monumental step forward in the world of particle physics. It expanded our understanding of the universe's fundamental building blocks and led to the development of the neutrino beam method, a technique that is still in use today in neutrino research. Laterman's legacy in the field of physics is profound. His research on neutrinos has opened up new frontiers in particle physics. Finally, we have Ada Yonath, the crystallographer who unraveled the mysteries of the ribosome. Born in Jerusalem, Yonath dedicated her life to unraveling the complex structure and function of the ribosome, the molecular machine within our cells that translates genetic code into proteins. Her pioneering work combined the techniques of X-ray crystallography and cryo-electron microscopy. Imagine the ribosome as a sophisticated factory churning out proteins, the building blocks of life. Yonath's work illuminated its structure in three dimensions, revealing how it works and interacts with antibiotics. This groundbreaking research has opened new avenues for developing advanced antibiotics, contributing significantly to the field of medicinal chemistry. In 2009, Yonath's remarkable contributions were recognized with the Nobel Prize in Chemistry, making her the first woman from the Middle East to win a Nobel in the sciences. Yonath's work has revolutionized our understanding of how cells make proteins. As we look back at these incredible Jewish scientists and their contributions, it's clear that their work has shaped our understanding of the world. Each of these individuals brought a distinctive perspective to science and through their tireless efforts, changed the course of human knowledge. Albert Einstein, with his theory of relativity, revolutionized our understanding of space, time, and gravity. Niels Bohr gave us unprecedented insights into the atom's structure, laying the foundation for modern atomic physics and quantum mechanics. Isidore Isaac Rabi's resonance method, which measured the magnetic properties of atomic nuclei, was a groundbreaking technique that continues to influence the study of nuclear physics. Jonas Salk's development of the first effective polio vaccine saved countless lives and brought hope to millions. In the realm of quantum electrodynamics, no one has made a more significant impact than Richard Feynman. His innovative approach to this field reshaped its landscape, earning him a shared Nobel Prize. Rosalind Franklin, through her work in X-ray crystallography, played a crucial role in our understanding of molecular structures, including that of DNA, the blueprint of life. Leon Letterman, alongside Melvin Schwartz and Jack Steinberger, made groundbreaking discoveries about neutrinos, the elusive particles that zip through the universe almost undetected. Francois Jacob, Jacques Monod, and André Loif's work on the genetic control of enzyme synthesis was a key development in molecular biology. Baruch S. Bloomberg's research into infectious diseases has had far-reaching implications for public health. Last but not least, Ada Yonath's work on the structure and function of the ribosome has had a profound impact on our understanding of how cells function. These are just a few examples of the countless contributions Jewish scientists have made to our world. Their work has touched every aspect of our lives, from the medicines we take to the technology we use every day. So, aren't we in a debt to Jews? They have done many good things for our life improvements. Think about it. Before we close this video, I want to take a moment to talk about the purpose of this channel. I am committed to providing unbiased, factual content that sheds light on the fascinating history of our world. Regardless of religion, race, or nationality, we are all part of a shared human experience. In this channel, we celebrate the contributions of individuals from all walks of life, with the hope of fostering a deeper understanding and appreciation of our shared history. If you've enjoyed this video and want to support the channel, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe. Your support allows me to continue creating content like this, and I'm deeply grateful for it. Remember, every like, every comment, and every subscription makes a difference. It's thanks to your support that I can keep bringing you videos every day. So don't forget to engage with the channel. Your support motivates me to continue doing what I love, and for that I am truly thankful.
So, let's keep exploring the pages of history together. Until next time, remember, knowledge is power, and the more we know, the better we understand our world. Thank you, and see you in the next video.